Here you are, Wufu. Jeez, I thought you were a real moving skeleton. <laughs> Did you know why we have bones in our bodies? Let knowledge clear. Imagine a body like a house. It needs a strong frame to stand upright. Just like that. We have bones because they act as the frame that supports our whole body. Thanks to our bones, we can stand up straight. Run, jump, grab things, or dance around with our bones to support us. Our bodies would just be a pile of skin and hair that couldn't stand up at all. Bones also help protect important parts inside our body, like the heart, brain, and lungs. Babies are born with around 300 soft bones that haven't joined together yet. As you grow, these bones slowly join together and get stronger, forming a total of 206 bones. Its bones can grow longer over time. That's how you get taller. I'll grow huh? tall like daddy, right, professor? Bones grow over time, but you need to take care of them if you want them to be strong and healthy. To help your bones grow strong, you should drink milk every day. It's full of calcium, which means healthy bones. You can also eat foods like cheese, spinach, and kiwi. They're all great for your bones. Hmm, I'll drink lots of milk so I can grow even taller than Daddy. That's all <laughs> for now. Stay tuned for our next exploration. Ow! Oh. <laughs> ah. oh. No! <laughs> oh! Huh? Wufu, your nails are way too long. Time for a trim. Hmm. But I just cut them last month. Your nails always grow. I'll explain why. Let knowledge click. Your nails aren't just for decoration or scratching. They also protect the tips of your fingers. Under your nail. There's a special area called the matrix, like a factory that's always working. New cells are made and push the old ones up. Together, they build your nail and push it out. That's how your nail grows longer. Even if you don't feel it, your nails grow a little every day. On average, a fingernail grows about 3 mm each month. Hmm. So my nails are growing now? Hmm. Huh? Exactly. And since they keep growing, if you don't trim them often, they can get too long and cause all kinds of trouble. That's not everything. Long nails are a perfect hiding place for germs and dirt. If you don't wash your hands well, the germs can sneak into your tummy. From now on, I'll check my nails every week. Let me clip them for you. <laughs> Wufu, how long haven't you showered? Mm. Mm. Do you know what will happen if we don't take a shower? Let knowledge click! Every day, a body comes into contact with a lot of dust, sweat, and bacteria from the environment. If we don't shower, dust and bacteria can build up. 
Making our skin dirty and stinky. Over time, your nose gets used to the smell. So you might not even notice it. However, people around you will clearly smell the bad odor. And that can be quite unpleasant. Your hair will start to get greasy because oil and dirt aren't washed away. I'm going to shower right now. Remember to wash thoroughly every area to avoid being stinky. Think of it. What are belly buttons for? Hmm. <laughs> Did you know why we have belly ah. buttons? <laughs> Let knowledge click. Huh. Hmm. When the baby is still in the womb, it can eat, wow. breathe, or drink <laughs> milk on its own. <laughs> Instead. The baby gets food from the mother through a special tube called the umbilical cord. Besides food, the umbilical cord also carry oxygen and nutrients from the mother to the baby. After birth, the umbilical cord isn't needed anymore. The doctor will cut it to separate the baby from the mother. After about 7 to 14 days, the umbilical cord will fall off on its own without causing any pain. Even though everyone's belly button looks a little different, it's a reminder that we all once live in our mom's tummy. The belly button doesn't do much, but it still needs to be kept clean like the rest of your body. Gently wash your belly button during bath time. Keep it dry afterward. And don't touch it with your dirty fingers. Wow, I got it! Discover everything around us on Wolfu Explore Channel.